Hi, I am with Ed Franz, head of BC Centro, a very good program here in Santa Barbara. How are you doing? I'm doing great, Viviana. Thanks for coming out. Yeah, it's good to have you in our show. Your program is so interesting, so helpful, and so fun at the same time. So why don't we start by telling our viewers what's the mission of BC Centro? So the mission of BC Centro is to empower bicyclists um, through having a space where they can work on their own bikes and they can learn to self-maintain a bike that they use to get wherever they need to go for transportation and for fun. Is it part of another program? Yes, uh, we're partnered with the Santa Barbara Bicycle Coalition. So while the mission of the coalition is to support area cyclists, the mission of BC Centro more specifically is to support bicyclists with a space where they can work on bikes and also work on projects, volunteer with kids programs, and otherwise get involved in bicycling in Santa Barbara. That's great. Now I understand you have uh, many program classes and activities for the community. So let's just start with a very popular class that you have, a street skills class. Yeah. What, what do you teach there? So we offer a street skills for cyclists class. And so who hasn't worried about going out and riding in traffic, right? Bicycling, everybody learns bicycling, you know, when they're a kid. But riding through traffic is a lot more challenging. And so we offer a 10-hour class that's some actually going through in a classroom setting the laws and strategies for riding in traffic as a bicyclist and some actually on the road experience. And that way, as a bicyclist, you feel confident to be a bicycle commuter and actually start riding for trips that you need to, say, get to work or trips to go get groceries. We also have an adults mechanics course. Mm -hmm. So let's say you ride a lot, but you've never been able to fix a flat tire yourself or uh, learn basic uh, mechanics. Well, we teach that over an eight week course. Besides these two classes, I understand you focus a lot on our youth here in Santa Barbara. So you have some after school programs. Tell yeah. me more about those. So we've just finished our summer programming where we did uh, youth mountain biking and we also did youth uh, road adventures where we take kids who've never ridden throughout certain parts of Santa Barbara on bike trips that they've never gone say more than 10 miles and we take them on an all-day bike trip and allow them the freedom to explore on a bicycle. Mm -hmm. And are you implementing these programs everywhere around Santa Barbara? Uh, well during the school year we have our youth earn a bike class and we have that at La Cumbra Junior High and we're actually looking to take that to more junior high schools and then uh, students who participate in that program can then start to participate in our, our bike adventure programs as well. So you can earn a bike with us and then we have opportunities for you to ride around and explore more areas of Santa Barbara all while having fun bicycling and also learning how to ride safely. Excellent. So I understand you have an open shop, right? So who benefits from this shop and how does it operate? So great, BC Centro's open shop is for everyone. Mm -hmm. It's a space where bicyclists or those wanting to become bicyclists can come in and use our shop, use our tools and our experience. We'll have volunteers that can help you repair your own bicycle. And so in that way, we kind of spread the skill of maintaining your own bike. And every day that we're open, which is Thursdays and Saturdays, as well as El Taller en Español, uh, Los Miércoles, mm, we're open on Wednesday for Spanish Book and Shop, we have more than 15 people come and use our six bike stands and through the hours that we're open get their bikes safely working. Do people donate bikes to you? Absolutely and that's a great way to support us in the Santa Barbara Bicycle Coalition by donating an old road bike or bike that would be useful for bicycle commuting we can inexpensively refurbish it and sell it to a commuter that may not be able to afford a new $400 bike but may very well be able to afford a $100 refurbished road bike that can get them to work safely and fast. Now, here in Santa Barbara, unfortunately, we have a lot of bikes that are stolen every year. What BC Centro is doing to prevent or reduce uh, bike robbery? Bike theft is a huge problem and such an annoyance when you rely on a bike for transportation. So, by providing a space where people can inexpensively keep their bikes operating and as well pick up a bike inexpensively that we know is not stolen because it's donated and we check the serial numbers, we can help in our own way fight bike theft. But what you as a bicyclist need to do to prevent bike theft is keep your bike locked. Use a lock, preferably a U-lock, that is difficult to cut with industrial cutters. You can lock your bike frame and your wheel to something that can't just be removed easily. And as well, try to keep your bike away from areas at night 
that might not be under surveillance. So for example, if you're leaving a bike overnight in a place that's dark, it's likely that that's the time that it's gonna get stolen. Uh, one of the best things to do in case your bike does ever get stolen is to keep the serial number. If you don't have the serial number of your bicycle, then you're not really gonna be able to recover it. So what I would recommend to any bike owner is to look up the National Bike Registry and to register their bike serial number. And that way, if they do get a bike stolen, they can probably recover it. Okay, so that's a good tip. Can people volunteer still? Yeah, we're always looking for volunteers at BC Centra. In fact, we run by volunteers. If you're a bicyclist and you've been looking for a way to contribute, you could operate the bike valet. At the Santa Barbara Bowl, we offer bike valet, uh, a service that we're looking to take to other parts of the community. We also use mechanics as volunteers, and we train anyone who's interested to be a better mechanic through volunteering here at BC Centro. So if you're interested to find out more or get involved with BC Centro, give us a call at 617-3255. Look us up at bccentro.org, that's B-I-C-I-C-E-N-T-R-O.org, or just email us at info at bccentro.org. Well, thank you, Ed, for all that information, and I wish the best for you and BC Center. Thank you, Viviana. You're welcome. For more information on the Nonprofit Spotlight, check our website at www.spchannels.tv. <laughs>